Hello and welcome. This is Yvonne's Diaries. My name is Yvonne Mangunda. And the reason why I decided to do this is because I feel like I need to speak to young people that are upcoming, that have a dream, that have a vision. And sometimes you just need somebody to tell you how it's happened for them. Not that it, you replicate the same journey as mine, but there's certain lessons that you can take from my journey. And the first thing I want to tell you is when you get in, especially for the young girls, don't get in thinking you have a disadvantage. When I look at myself, I look at myself as somebody who's gone to a white party and they're wearing purple. And the reason why I say that is, as a woman already, you stand out from the crowd, especially in male-dominated environments like my environment. When I go on radio, I look at it as an advantage because when my male co-stars talk about sport, it's something that people hear all the time. It's nothing new. It's the norm. But when you hear ladies talk about sport, it's like you sit back and you're like, whoa, wow. So at the end of the day, you also need to put in the work. But at the same time, don't look at your gender as a disadvantage. Look at your gender as an advantage. Because a lot of times you hear these feminists speaking in your ear saying, you know what, it's very hard. It's uh, uh. Yes, it's going to be very hard. They're not going to roll the red carpet. But get in there thinking my gender is my advantage whether you're going to be a mechanic imagine if you see a female mechanic and a male mechanic a female pilot and a male pilot you're already amazed by the fact that they're there but what they then need to do is ensure that they work hard so that you don't get into that stereotype that people are expecting you they're expecting you to fail don't fail get in there work hard but at the same time don't go in there expecting them to roll the red carpet because believe me they will not